hello everyone welcome back to another video in today's video i will take a couple of trades with the alligator indicator that's pretty simple we basically will take a couple of trades with the trend okay so when you add this indicator this is a the default setting you don't have to change any settings and the way we take our trades is that we just have to find good trends like this we need to take our trades in some trendy market for example here let me see if we can have the opportunity we'll go for four minutes say. okay after this candle kind of close i will go with the buyers okay and the way this strategy works uh, after finding your trendy market let me just take this real quick let's go boom okay i go double yeah so this indicator right here it's gonna play as a level okay so every single time that we retrace this level and we see the bullish sign we can enter the trade okay for three to five minutes you see every single time the price comes and these two lines these two moving averages they bounce up okay so we basically take our trades in the direction of the trend that's uh, one of the advantages of trading with this strategy okay this is um, if you really like trading with indicators this is very very profitable I mean it's not gonna be profitable at the you know the day you start you have to work on that okay you have to work on that uh, find your um, strength and weaknesses in this strategy okay so here again it tried to touch this and after this candle basically we would enter but if we were entering here one two three four we would lose the trade right here but you have to little uh you know consider the market structure as well but you know we we have tried this like a five times and then we have strong you know bullish movement and then we creating this consolidation area so the trend is kind of weak okay we can even add the stochastic just to detect the oversold and overbought areas for example here if you want to take the trade after this one you see that uh, it's not an overbought position so you can take the trade but here let me see here would be somewhere here yeah, it's coming down but anyways you can you can uh you know have a couple of uh you know you can have creativity using this strategy or any strategy in general okay we will take a couple of trades okay look at this one we have this engulf and this intersection this is a very good signal though to take no worries i will take a couple of trades and you will see that okay here you see that uh, we have a ranging market this is not a trending market this is a ranging market so we don't take the trade on this market let me see yeah this is a very good strategy by the way okay you see that the price previous time uh retrace this line right here and then drop and again it's trying to retrace but this time we didn't create a lower low so this is kind of a strength of the buyer so we don't go against this we don't go with the sellers at this one so you have to always consider uh, the market structure as well so here i'll go with the buyers uh and even though we have you know in the overbought position with this indicator you know i'm not even using this one i just wanted to show you some okay I'm not like we're gonna use only alligator indicator and you see that after retracing here we got this engulfing pattern then we can enter all right this trade is about to close and we only trade on pullbacks these are all pullbacks okay the good thing about this strategy is uh, it's in the direction of the trend see yeah again you see that the price just is super hairy and long weeks and ranging market you don't trust this 
Okay, these two trades are closed and we have a running trade right here. Okay, again, bad market. We don't use this strategy in bad markets. Here also as well, we need trendy markets. Okay, here the trend is trying to change and we can count on the pullbacks. So this pullbacks and take the pullback trades. Okay, so I will add this up there so we can have this. All right. Okay, we missed this chance right here. You see that this is a clear pullback, but since the market is kind of... No, we got the trend here. But yeah, we didn't take the trade. Okay, here I'm looking for a bullish sign, uh, like engulfing or something, and then I can take the trade, but it doesn't show me. Okay, again, we're trying to look at this. This is kind of same, right? This is kind of same. And again, it's trying to retrace this line. Okay, let's see how deep it's going to come uh, into the indicator. Let's see if we're going to see the bullish sign. This is a trendy market like look at this one this is a kind of ranging market okay this is ranging but we need trendy markets this is the trendy market you see the, the, the uptrend so here as soon as i see some bullish sign i see that the, they are trying to come again pull back i will take the trade but for now i don't see any bullish sign and this trade is about to close, yes. Okay, still uh, haven't seen a bullish sign here. Okay, I see a bullish sign. I go with the buys right here. You see that the previous time also we got, you know, bullish activity this time also. This time also. For example, here, you would take the trade and win, okay? Here, if you was if you were taking the trade, you're probably going to lose. And here, let's say you're going to win. So, you win two trades and lost one. And losing trades are always here. And you shouldn't be scared of losing trades. But here, you see that the seller's entry, this is basically on the seller's entry. And kind of risky, but I don't care. I just want to show you this strategy. Again, you see that the uh, previous time we got this one and then started the trend. So maybe I can trust this one. Let's go with the buyers. This is also round number, right? So maybe this is strong and this is going to do exact same thing as before. But this is not a strong bullish candle. Okay. But since we have the trend line and we got this candle right here on the trend line and also this is kind of pullback just as the previous time you see how similar they are okay i uh, i thought we might bounce back so i take this trade okay show how beautiful this strategy is man i don't mind if you drop Let's see. Okay, but apparently it's not gonna do the same as previous time, but we'll see the result. Okay, here I go with the sellers because you see that the trend was uptrend, right? This is the trend, which was uptrend. And here, it broke, like, the moving average is 
crossing and the trend is kind of changing okay and then we got this bearish sign right here just as this one so we can expect a drop okay we can expect a drop based on the market structure but if you look at the other way you can draw this trend line and you see that we are still on the trend line but let me see this Yeah, in three minute time frame, you see that the we are still in the uptrend and we can bounce up. Okay, so this trade is about to be a losing trade. And these two still running. Let's see. Yeah, we lost this one. Okay, so we clearly see that the sellers are pretty strong here. We might drop since we didn't really create a high high and this is only a shadow and we are moving at this price channel. Okay. So I'll be waiting for, you know, this one clearly break and then retest and then I will take the retests as um, an opportunity let's see but let me see which one, which one was that this one yeah I'll go with the buyers for one minute after this okay I'm expecting a bullish candle right, let me just this one close I'll go with the buyers this is out of, yeah, I mean, this is not based on the strategy though. Okay, this is a winning trade. Okay. And then we got this one, it's playing around and... And then we got this one. Okay, this is very clear, I mean, look at this. The, cl the trend is super clear that the bars will enter. That's why I take this trade. Okay, but this one actually tricked me so clearly the trend line was the problem here okay clearly the trend line was the problem and we basically traded against the trend trend is not completely changed at this market but it's still we might win the trade okay if you you are trading this strategy please be careful Okay, please be careful about the trade. Okay, this trade is closed. No, this one. This one was a trade. And you see that the house similar, it's moving. And this one was also a winning trade. Oh my god. Thank god. Okay. Yeah. You can see, you can say that I'm kind of sleepy right now. And yeah. I really. I am really happy that I can share all of this with you. My good trades, bad trades and everything. Just let me know in the comments if you like this. I will share every single trading sessions with you. Thank you for watching guys. If you really like this, please drop a like for me. And you can practice all in the demo account. That's also in the description. Thank you and peace out.